Hey everyone, today we have a short video to show you how you can use the FBN platform to choose top performing seed for your soil types. We have thousands of farmers that have joined the FBN network and anonymously contributed planting and harvest files. What we've done is aggregated these millions of acres worth of data to create a powerful real world seed performance database called FBN Seed Finder. Now let's dig in to how you can use this tool to help choose seeds on your farm. One of the great things about FBN is you can use it to pinpoint areas of your operation where you can improve. We're going to navigate to My Operation, click on the Fields tab, and look and see what are fields that could potentially perform better in the future. As you can see, these are all the fields that planted corn in 2016, and you can see that some fields, like Mom's East 32, are outperforming other farmers within the network, while other fields, like Dad's 20, has room for improvement. Based on this information and FBN benchmarking, you can then dive in and see how you can improve the yield and profitability potential of those fields. So now we can dig into Dad's 20 and see why this field might be underperforming. So first I'm going to click on Dad's 20 here and then navigate to varieties and you can see that there was two DeKalb varieties that were planted on this field both of which were underperforming compared to other farmers within the FBN network. And when you click on variety by soil, you can also see that based off the soil types in this field, this variety was underperforming on all of those soil types. So this shows me that potentially another variety might be a better fit for this field. From there, we're going to navigate to the yield potential page. What yield potential does is it analyzes the soil types in a field and queries the seed finder database to locate the varieties that have performed best on those soils in the real world across the network. So this is what the home yield potential page looks like. You can sort by crop, maturity, brand, as well as others. You can see products over here on the left side that are top performing products based on the soil type in that field, as well as see what potential revenue would be compared to the previous year that you're comparing it to, which in this year is 2016. Yield potential is a great way to discover new varieties for your operation. As I mentioned earlier, on the left hand side you can see varieties that are estimated to have the highest yield if you were to plant them across the entire field in bushels per acre. Again, this is taken into account the fact that both Rob and Drummer make up a significant portion of this field. You can also click into these soil types to see top varieties just based off that one specific soil type. Then, when you navigate back to yield potential, these varieties on the left hand side are taking into account the fact that Rob and Drummer are making up a significant portion of this field. You can search specific varieties, you can save specific varieties under My Favorites, and you can navigate through the list to see what different options are available. So if we click on this DeKalb seed, for example, you can then see what the estimated yield potential is for this field if you were to plant this variety as opposed to the varieties you planted in the previous year. Then, if you wanted to dig further into this information, you can click on Product Info and you'll navigate to Seed Finder. In Seed Finder, you can see thousands of acres of real-world information on varieties you're considering. You can scroll through things like nitrogen application, row spacing, and seeding rate to see what top performing practices are for a seed that you may not have planted on your operation before. So here, for example, you can see that you can plant at a lower population, maintain the same yield, and therefore saving on buying more seed than you might need. Scrolling up, you can then click on the prices tab and see what other farmers are paying for this bag of seed. This is based off of real seed invoices that farmers submit to the network, which we then turn into this pricing information to get you the average price for this bag of seed. As you can tell, members pay widely different prices for the same seed. Knowing the market average price can help you with your negotiations. So now that we've gone through how to find new seeds for your soil types and fields, we'll show you how you can access the raw power in the Seed Finder database. You can search over 4,000 seeds across millions of acres in this database. You're currently looking at every seed grown across the FBN network with sufficient amount of production data. 
So let's use the filters to look, locate the DeKalb hybrid that we were considering. So if we go in and search this DeKalb variety, you can see the top level statistics that you saw when you dug into that product. Additionally, as you'll see on some other varieties, there's not this as sold as button right here. So for example, if we looked at one of the LG varieties that was also mentioned as a top performing variety on that soil, if this was one of the seeds you're looking at, you can see if it has this also sold as button. What this means is basically the same genetics are used in different brands. So this LG seed variety here is also sold with those same genetics as a producer's hybrid as well as an agrigold. There's a lot of information within Seed Finder that you can use to help with seed selection. You can go toggle everything between year, previous crop, irrigation, and more. So as you can see, FBN members have many useful resources when it comes to seed selection. There really is no one right way to select seed, and you know much more about your farm than anyone else. But with the FBN Seed Finder, it lets you turn the world into your plot trial. Get started with FBN Seed Finder today. Already an FBN member? Just log into your account and navigate to the Seed Finder button. Note that you may still need to add files and upload planting and harvest data. Have questions on how to do this? You can reach us at support at farmersbusinessnetwork.com or call your account representative. If you're not an FBN member yet, it only takes about five minutes to set up and you can do this at www.farmersbusinessnetwork.com or call 844-200-FARM.